All right, all right, all right, guys. What is up? Average Gamer signing on back with another video. Another week, another VGC challenge. Reg G just dropped. Finally, we've been waiting. First restricted format of Scarlet and Violet. And so, to honor the new format, we got to do new challenges. And so, we got the random Pokemon team generator. I don't want to make my team. Let's have a website do it for me. Shout out Poke Random. <laughs> so, uh, your boy is going to cheat a little bit. Everything I get is going to be fully evolved. I'm not I'm not dealing with mid-stage mons, all right? They actually don't have VGC format in here, so we'll just do all formats because, you know, we need a restricted mon. All regions, obviously, so we don't just get one uh, region team because we already did that video. And then, obviously, Scarlet and Vita. Okay, here are my general rules, right? In the event that we do not get a restricted Pokemon, we are allowed to re-roll. If we get a mythical Pokemon, it's an automatic reroll. Okay? But for the former, if we do not get a restricted, we are allowed to reroll, but we're only allowed to do that twice. So in total, we can get a potential three rolls. Our first roll, our second roll if we want to try for a restricted, and then our third. If we don't get a restricted on our third, we're forced to use it until the second roll kicks in. If that roll is a mythical, we get to re-roll for free. So those are the those are the rules I'm kind of thinking. I kind of just thought that in my head. <laughs> we may have find an easier way to do this as time goes on. But for our first video of random team creation, I think those are solid rules. So let's go ahead and get our team. But before that, be sure to like and subscribe. It helps me out a lot. Let me know what kind of content to make. We are on our way to 300 subs. Let's be a part of that journey together now i held y'all up long enough let's generate this team okay as we see here automatic mythical baby i think pitch runs a mythical i don't think you can use it so free reroll. oh what okay we got we got a team dope groudon ampharos crocodile executor go go and great tusk <laughs> oh oh my god this one I'm I've never used Ampharos once in my life. Go Go is the goat. I love this Pokemon. Executor, I have no idea. Great Touch and Kugadal I've used before. It's gonna be really weird. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and uh, see what we can cook up with this team, man. I'm actually kind of excited for this one. Alright, so we are here on Pokemon Scarlet and Violet with, of course, our random generated team. First off, let me apologize as I try to get these VGC challenges out on Fridays now, but obviously it's Saturday, so it's late. <laughs> Your boy is actually graduating, so I've been busy touching grass. I don't usually do that, but I have to. <laughs> Not to mention, I actually didn't have a Groudon. I don't know how, but I didn't, so I had to spend hours getting one in a prior game, <laughs> and that was a complete mess. Uh, regardless, we are here, and I actually like what we made, so let's go ahead and talk about it. Speaking of Groudon, he's our first up. Obviously, my restricted Pokemon. Um, Presto's Blades uh, needed, obviously. Heat Crash needed, obviously. Uh, Thunder Wave I actually chose. I think I originally had like Dragon Claw or something. But I think Thunder Wave is actually a little better. Because Speed Control is limited on this team. And as we talk with our other Mons, uh, although I have Trick Room, as some of y'all may see, I want another thing just in case I don't want Trick Room. So... Having Thunder Wave, I think, is nice. And, of course, I get those good old hacks, baby. Uh, I don't really know how people adapted to this format yet. It's still relatively new. I know I had a video uh, a while, probably not a while back, but a couple days ago, talking about my first kind of experiences with Reg G. I was on Showdown. But I don't know, like, the actual EVs people are running, running yet. So I kind of was just very general here, uh, as you'll see with all my Pokemon. Uh, I might be faster than non-Scarf Urshifu's, might not, who knows. <laughs> have a clear amulet to stop Intimidate from uh, Incineroar primarily, and Grass Terra just to have a better matchup against Kyogre upon switching when it attempts to stop my son. It will most likely go for a water move instead of something like Ice Beam, so getting Terra Grass on it is required, in my opinion. And plus I expect a lot of Kyogres to probably be specs, so locking them into a move that I resist is pretty good. Next up, I got the Sunsetter. I need the Sun User, baby. Great Tusk with Protosynthesis. Obviously, Life Orb. Damage, baby. 
Water, Terra again, Kyogre issue. <laughs> uh, headlong Rush for good stab. I didn't think I needed a fighting move, so I just went Ice Spinner to get rid of potential terrains. And Iron Head for Flutter Main. Uh, this actually is speed boosting, Great Tusk. So, no attack investment, because I couldn't, <laughs> or else it wouldn't have been speed boosted. But again, just having another means of speed control. In terms of EVs, I wanted to live like a Specs Flutter Moonblast, so that's what this is for, EV-wise. With Terra, obviously, I'm not living that thing, I'm super effective. Great Tusk Special Defense sucks. <laughs> but when I Terra, it'll be alright. Well, hopefully. Okay, next up, the boy, Go Go, one of the best of Gen 6, baby, with the Miracle Seed and Sap Sipper. Come in on those pesky Amoonguses and those Rillabooms who try to spam grass moves in my face. Not to mention, this thing is very slow, so it'll be our Trick Room Attacker, and we'll get to our Trick Room Setter in a bit. Leaf Blade, obviously, for Stab. Throat Chop, just to stop things, like Sound Moves, Hyper Voice from, like, Ferrigarath, or, like, uh, Blood Moon or Saluna. Obviously, since I have Trick Room, which we'll talk about in a second, as I said, uh, a lot of people will probably attempt to stall it out, especially if they're running, like, Torn or something like that. So, having Milk Drink as an option, just for a recovery, I think could be pretty good. And, obviously, you need Protect, alright? Not to mention, Gogo's actually more bulky than I thought. I should be able to live in Astral Barrage from Calyrex and then do damage to it with Throat Shot, which is really nice. And obviously I just went Fairy Terror just for general good defenses. I was going to go from like Fire, but I wanted to keep uh, my Ursa and Luna matchup pretty good. Because kind of depending on how the IVs are with uh, com other Ursa and Lunas, I might be able to outspeed it under Trick Room. Speaking of Trick Room, the boy Executor. Uh, Harvest with Groudon is very nice. Endless Citrus Berries, baby. Dark Terra to avoid Taunt, primarily from uh, Tornadoes. But also to stop things like Shadow Ball from Fluttermane for him being super effective. And also remove my Fire Weakness to Incineroar, just in case I want to go something like Groudon Executor, get Trick Room up immediately. So Gig Drain as my stab move of choice, and Sludge Bomb. Sludge Bomb primarily for Grass Terras. Uh, Trick Room, obviously, and then Protect. This thing can just stay on the field if I get rid of everything that's super effective against it, so. Yeah, <laughs> we're going to try to get an Executor Sweep today, baby. Next up, uh, Ampharos. Pokemon I never used before, but I actually ended up liking. Uh, another Trick Room attacker, his base speed I think was like 60. Um, so again, depending on how the IVs of my opponents are, I cannot speed, I cannot, kind of depends. Uh, Flying Terra, obviously, to stop ground moves. Got the Assault Vest on it. Which means I can live a not without rain, so I can bring my Groudon in to stop rain. I can live a Specs Kyogre Water Spout, which in my opinion is kind of needed. Uh, Thunderbolt for stab, Electro Web, more speed drops. Again, I kind of want multiple speed options with this team. Focus Blast and Dazzling Gleam as coverage moves. And lastly, the boy, one of the best in Gen 5, the boy Crocodile. Uh, this is very basic, no need to. Be that uh, specific. Intimidate Choice Scarf. Uh, intimidate instead of Moxie just to help out Executor even more if I need. Uh, scarf, so I'm faster than Calyrex. That's really all you gotta know. <laughs> Cyber Tantrum, knock off. Dragon Claw to get rid of uh, Maridons and Karidons that might not be expecting me to be scarfed. And Gunk Shot for Fairies. Okay, that's the squad. Honestly, for a first random generated team, I think we got a lot of stuff that has some decent synergy. Groudon setting up the sun for Great Tusk and Executor, having access to Trick Room and also having like okay Trick Room attackers in Go-Go and Ampharos, and then having an Intimidate support and, and also just general good Scarfer in Kruk that has a lot of coverage. So, I actually I actually think we, <laughs> I actually like it, I'm not gonna lie, I think we can get some dubs. And we're probably gonna be low ladder because it's a new uh, season, I don't know what they call season, series, whatever it's called. And so, we're going to probably face some other creative stuff, so I'm very excited. As always, team code is in the top right, as well as the description. I'm excited. Let's see if we can catch some gubs. Let's get, in Let's get into it. Okay, first opponent. Rim Pokeball tier, by the way. Crazy. I gotta start playing on ladder more. <laughs> I usually only play on ladder for these uh, VGC challenges. I gotta actually... Gotta rank up, baby. We're trying to get to Master Ball tier. Um, okay... Been a while since I faced a Cresselia, obviously. Honestly, excuse me. Um, I honestly feel like I could probably just get away with Trick Room here. Hmm. 
Hmm. It's so weird because I don't... He has a couple of leads that can kind of just stop me. I kind of want to go with this, though. I feel like that's probably the safest lead. Because I don't want him to get that Grinstarl up that easily. Hmm. I'm gonna do this. We kind of have very contradicting, contradicting, that's not the word. Uh, in the event he leads like something like Incineroar, uh, Calyrex Shadow, I think this, I think a great Tusk Groudon lead covers most options. I was thinking about leading Crook immediately, but if he leads Incineroar, that's kind of pointless. Okay. This is okay. Oh god, how many Pressless Blade misses am I gonna get this freaking uh, run? I don't know. This is fine. Let's go for Pressless Blades immediately. I don't know who he wants to fake out. Because he's probably going to fake out. Okay. About half, that's fine. Uh, if we can kill him here, we can get one screen up, which is very nice. Okay. Press. Uh, okay. It's not bad. Um, I do want to Thunder Wave this thing. And I will switch out to Executor here. Yeah, these things are going to be an issue, but have to kind of deal with it. Get the full pair, which is very nice. Uh, I don't really know how these things are trained for my pump, but this is very passive. I almost expect Calyrex Shadow to be in the back. Like, I, I would probably expect that, because he doesn't have much damage with these first three mons. Just gonna get some chip off on the crest. I think this heat crash should kill. Uh, uh, maybe not through reflect, but but honestly, stalling out reflect turns is fine because I'm not really expecting damage out of these two. All right, we kill through, which is nice. Icy wind. Okay. This Calyrex Shadow, I'm trick rooming. And I probably will tear my executor, regardless. Uh, I got Cherry Coke, man. Playing Pokemon, what more can you ask for? Part of me kind of just wants to switch out again. Honestly. How many more turns of sun do we got? Two? Hmm. I want to do this just so I can get a reset of sun. 
Then I'll protect. Da -da -da. I actually like the gym leader's music a little bit, except for that part. Okay. I've not seen a darkest Larry in forever. No knockoff is interesting. Yeah, this crest isn't really doing anything. I think I'm gonna be fine. Honestly, I think I'd rather go for. Oh, actually, no. I probably should not have done this. Uh, that's okay though. I think this Hellar Armor will kill unless he tarot's. So, I think I might have been overzealous here. I did not need to do this. Let's hope this kills, or else I'm screwed. Okay. If he flippers me, I'm probably dead. Which is why I didn't want to do this. Wasn't really thinking. Uh, I'm a ground type. Okay. Oh, he's just dark as Lariat's again. I might live this. Yeah. Okay, big mistake on his part. Okay. Going to reset sun. Yeah, I'm just gonna tear it now. Why not? Let's see if I hit the instant roar. Yes, sir. Crit. Love to see it. Mm-hmm. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, Calyrex. Okay. Your light screen should be over soon. Huh. Unnerve. Uh huh. Oh well. Honestly, if I can get a heat crash off to break slash, I don't think I died a one hit even from this range. So, eh, eh. Let's protect trick room. I don't think I die. Ghost. Okay. I still don't think I die. <laughs> If 
I do, that sucks. Dang it! Oh, it's a crit, okay. <laughs> he crit me, alright. That's fine. Oh my god, now I gotta deal with this dumb thing. Dang, that really screwed me over. Hmm. Uh. Options, options. I think I want to do this first. Let me turn two. Huh. Uh, do I think this thing protects here? Because he knows I now have speed, so he knows I'm faster. I think the play from him is protect Icy Wind. Like, I'm actually fairly confident that it is. I'd be shocked if it's not. God, but he doesn't seem like a per- I'm still- I'm still gonna do it. This would be the right play. Okay, he didn't protect. Bummer, but what you gonna do? There's been a lot of crits. Him not protecting their doesn't. Uh, whatever. And the crit kinda ended the game anyway. I think I made overall the right decisions though. The team actually flows pretty nice, which is good. Crit really messed me up there. Yeah, I probably should have eh, the I don't like underestimating people on the little ladder, but still. I probably just should have attacked him. I don't think I live Ghost Terra. I definitely not not with those uh, boosts. So. A uh, bummer, but we made the right decisions in my eyes. This thing is most likely sashed. Yeah, we got Trick Room up. We definitely won that. All right, GG. Next game, uh, fellow Trick Room team, which is cool. We have a torn mode as well. Um. I feel like I definitely bring Crook. I think I definitely bring Crook. Hmm. Does he do Indeedy something or Torn something? I'm gonna bring Ampharos, why not? Something like that. Yeah, let's try this. I don't think Torn Calyrex is that much out of the question, especially because I have potential speed booster Great Tusk, which will probably not necessarily predict, but it'll probably be in the back of his mind. Uh, if he goes in DD, this also works fine. Cause I can knock off potential rocky helmet or whatever. Okay, indeed you. This is also fine. But now, do I expect him to go for follow me? Cause I can kill this uh thing immediately. Or 
Or do I just risk the focus block? Actually, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, so I can see. Okay, so no knocking off. Ooh, okay. A jetpack. Huh. Well, what else is coming in? So he's definitely overheat, right? We're getting that jetpack out the way now is actually really good for us. It's actually the only reason I did not bring Groudon. on. Because I don't need this thing going off. I feel like on that team, Chiyu actually has the potential of being scarfed. Which would be very bad. But who is this? Oh my god. Okay. Hmm. Huh. So, he definitely, uh, what's it called? Do I Electro Web here? Yeah, I'm faster anyway, it doesn't really matter. Uh, should I just T-Bolt for damage? Cause I'm not gonna be, a I kinda wanna break the Sash though. Yeah, I kinda wanna break the Sash off rip. Ooh, but if he's, but if he doesn't go for follow me, I'd rather just do this. Oh, I hate this Pokemon so much. Okay, it's Fairy Terra. Wonderful. Okay, he does go for follow me. Uh, is this Terra Blast? It better not be. Ooh, did a lot of damage. Oh, it was a crit. Dang, we're getting a lot of crits today. Dang, okay, it does run Draining Kiss. Okay. Unfortunate, but it's whatever. I definitely should have gone for Electro Web now. Definitely should have gone for Electro Web. Did not prep correctly for this. But that's okay. Because <clears throat> I'm Dark Terroring now. And then I'm popping Trick Room. Yeah, I should have Electro Web. It would have set me up late game just in case something went wrong. But I still have this, so it's not particularly over. Okay. God, why are there so many crits? Oh my gosh, okay. Uh, so many crits. Okay. This is double protect. No, it's not. Huh. That is not the Pokemon I expected him to protect. That is not the Pokemon. Okay. That really sucks. This guy's not playing at all what I thought. I just doubled it. I uh, probably wouldn't have killed, but. How do you protect. I don't know. Hmm. Double up on Calyrex is way too obvious, in my opinion. Hmm. These guys are playing very weird. But, low ladder. What can you do? Hmm. Hmm. Hmm.
Yeah, could have just gone for Gleam here. It's probably already over, so. And, uh, okay. If I knew you were going to do that, I just would have doubled the Calyrex. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. If I knew you were going to do some mess like that, I just would have doubled the Calyrex. So he ran three attacks on his. Oh, that's still. Oh god. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're learning the format. We're learning. All right. Uh, is that a charter bug? <laughs> okay. Part of me wants to do this. If he leaves Torn, that wouldn't be as good. I think it's better if I do this. And since I probably would take... Would I'm probably gonna have to tear a, a great tusk in this situation, both if he leads off with the flutter main. Or or the Jason, both of which are pretty likely. So I don't think the executor is that good. Potential Chi in the back just destroys me. Kinda means I have to bring Crook. I'm gonna have to really make use of Thunder Wave and Electro Web here. Would white to bring Go Go because I think this Rillaboom probably comes, but it's all right. Yeah. Okay. It's not the worst lead for us though. Would this thing be faster than me under Tailwind? I would doubt it. Um, I would highly doubt this thing be faster than me under Tailwind. I don't know who he fakes out, though, if he does that as well. I'm just going to do this. He fakes out that. That's fine. Okay, he just automatically goes for Bleak Wind. Yes, go! Skillful avoid. Double avoid. Skillful. A lot of luck happening right now. Gotten like five crits so far this video. Half health is pretty good. Oh, so we're just going for bleak ones. Okay. Mm. Okay. Uh... Do I really need this? <clears throat> it would be very helpful against Zacian. 
And Chiyu. Huh. I kind of want to keep this, but I don't know who I switch. Having three ground types sucks. And I do have Scarf Crook, so it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Let's do this. Ooh. Burn out that Chiyu, baby. Fluttermane. Frick. That's okay. You're popping tail in here, aren't you? Oh, you're protecting. This is not horrible. We're not in a, that bad of a position. Hmm. The problem is, though, I don't want to give this thing sun. And I would... <sighs> speed boosting just infinitely more common as well. But I could just Terra. How much mileage do I get off of Terra in this situation? I think a lot, actually. If I can just kill this immediately. If he procs Tailwind here, that's better for me. So, let's do this. Please don't be. Please. Okay, we're fairy here. Thank God. Okay. This has the potential to be okay. I can kill this, my Groudon can get in <clears throat> without giving a benefit to him. Unless his last Pokemon's Chiyu. Which, given all my ground types, I doubt. Okay, it is the Tailwind. So, Ampharos will go down here. Unless he just Moonblasts. Okay, he just Dazzling Gleam. It crit me! Oh my god, dude! <laughs> Gee, I'm getting crit! My god. I'm getting crit so much. Oh my gosh. Unbelievable. The team's actually working. <laughs> That's the problem. He did exactly what I thought, too. Depending on who his last Pokemon is, I actually could have won this game as well. So we're 2-1, no luck. <laughs> Which, honestly, I appreciate. Uh, what's this? Yeah, it is speed. Jesus Christ. Well, game's over, so. <laughs> the game's just over. I've been getting crit so much. life orb Jesus Christ and he hit the bleak one okay uh I can't be mad I can't be mad I'm mad that it's that this kind of luck is having me in low ladder because I would like to rank up <laughs> uh but you know that's fine all right let's get our next one we got to get a W we got to okay we're 0 and 3 we actually demoted to pokeball tier 4 dude Oh, uh, we've been getting hacked, bro. We've been getting hacked. Um, this team is weird. And I like that. Oh, wow, so I've seen a Garchomp. Huh. Why is this? The sun is there for something. I just don't know what it is. Does the wind cut have like chlorophyll or something? I don't know. The only thing I've ever known about freaking wind cut is that it has prankster. Uh. Hmm. I probably would want crocodile here. Crocodile Ampharos probably isn't like that bad. If he leaves you out on immediately, I'll be for it to switch. It sucks. 
Uh, I'm gonna go go go. We'll just do that. I couldn't really think I was too busy freaking coping that I'm losing to hacks. So I wasn't really thinking. Hopefully this works. Oh yeah, basic trainer card gang. Forgot to say that first match. Uh, who are these? Okay. Dark type version too. Okay. I don't feel like potentially missing dunk shot though. Most likely banded uh, or sashed, so I kind of want to get this out of here. Intimidate helps out a lot. Thank you. Okay, so we'll pick up the kill on uh, this thing. Uh, maybe. Okay, thank God. <laughs> Yeah, I just let Kruger out die. Just break a potential sash on you. Ooh, we're terroring. Steel? Okay, that's fine. Oh god. Uh, this is okay. Can't really have anything switch in. Hmm. Uh, don't know why we're doing this. We're rage powdering, but I'm just gonna bring in Grod on and press those blades, so. Hopefully I hit. Uh, what's happening? Let me switch in my grout on. I can win! God dang it. Oh my god. Okay, if you're gonna... <clears throat> Can we hurry up and disconnect then? My gosh. Okay, there we go. Let's get our next one. Okay, this is going to be our last one. Hopefully we can get a dub here. I feel like I've played... The name looks familiar. I think I've played Scout for. Got our ride on, which is really cool. Okay. We could actually do some work here, I think. Who do I want to lead off with is the question. I don't even know who he would lead in this scenario. I don't want to leave my crook, so I don't want that thing getting a potential guard dog on me. I think that's his ability. Uh, okie dokies. Um...
Yeah, I'll just elite Groudon Ampharos. Ampharos, just in case he brings the Gyarados, and I don't want to get intimidated just yet. I don't want to bring both Great Tusk and Crook, because I definitely want Gogo to kill the Gastrodon. Which one would I rather have? I think I'd rather have Great Tusk to avoid potential Guard Dog altogether. I should be faster than most of his team anyway. Well, Great Tusk should be faster, so. Unless it's like Scarf Okie Doge or anything, I should be alright most of the time. And Buzz I have Iron Head just in case he wants to Fairy Terra. So, I think we're in a good spot. He actually doesn't have a Restricted, which I respect. Because these things will become the bane of my existence. Especially if they're gonna crit me. Okie dokie and Ogre Palm. Okay. Solid decision on our part. We could land a pressure blaze, that would be fantastic. Yeah, we'll do this. Okay, I don't die to that. We hit both, which is great. Okay. Our Groudon should be faster now. We're not max speed on our Groudon. Obviously. <laughs> you guys probably guessed that by the fact I did not die. Uh, yeah, we're not max speed. But I still think we should be faster. We're already ahead so much, I think, so I think I can risk the Focus Blast. If he wants to do this, then fine. Could potentially be flying Terra. That actually would make a lot of sense. Uh, water also fine. Hmm. Okay. We're landing our Presto's blade, so we're pretty. I'll take that luck at least. I'll take that luck. Ooh, we're just going. To... Okay, that's what's the plan. Gotcha. So both Pokemon are dead here. Oh, wow, Ampharos. That bulk on Ampharos really be coming in clutch. Uh, we're gonna lead. And we hit the Focus Blast. Yes, sir. You're dead. You're dead. Okay, Great Tusk can come clean up. Uh, what's this? <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, Great Tusk, come clean up. Um, uh, there actually is a way I could lose this, I think. Does he go for a potential double protect? Because I feel like my op... God, I don't know if this... Raging Bolt's Assault Vest or not. It could just flat out Terra, though. No way he Thunderclaps me. I'm gonna Terra Water just to live a hit. So no way he Terra's his Ogre Pond at such low HP. So... I don't want to drop my defenses either. I'm gonna go for this. Then I'm gonna go for this. Yeah, he already teared up anyway, so don't have to really risk anything here. Okay. Yeah. 
He crit me. Dude, I, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> This team actually somewhat works. That's the that's the funny thing. It's actually somewhat working, but I keep getting crit. <laughs> and honestly, that's more luck than than the amount of preferless blades I've hit. Jesus Christ. Go goat lives, cause go goat is the goat. You ain't critting the boy. Get out of here. Jesus Christ. <laughs> never been more annoyed in my life okay we got one dub that, we're gonna end it off here cause I'm gonna go insane <laughs> oh my god beginning rings are kicking my behind cause I keep getting crit little Timmy can just pick up the controller and beat me with some <laughs> with crits oh my god okay well that's gonna do it for this video fun challenge we're definitely gonna do more random battles in the future but please, like and subscribe for my pain. <laughs> I do this for you guys and myself because I love Pokemon. But I don't like getting crit. So, I think this actually was successful. Because honestly, of what the, well, one game got cut. So, of the four games I played, I think I actually won three of them. <laughs> okay? But I didn't get freaking hacked. <laughs> so, that's going to do it for this video. I like and subscribe if you enjoyed Take a look at my other content if you, uh, if that suits you, you know, I don't know. God, this outro is so scuffed because I'm actually so mad right now. <laughs> All right, Average Gator signing off. I'll see y'all next time.